A while back I'd seen the, uh, the Project Inspire videos, my wife and I watched them, and we were very inspired and we thought you know, how much we would love to do, be involved in Kirov if something would ever come our way. Toyota gas pedal recall is expanding this morning. On Wednesday, Toyota called another 1.1 million vehicles. They have accelerators that may get stuck on floor mats. I had to take the car to be serviced to have this recall problem. Entered in there, I was late, and I sat down, this woman across from me, and she was doing the paperwork. And I apologized to her for being late, the traffic, and she said, yeah, I know New York traffic. And one thing after another, I don't know, somehow we got into, she mentioned that she was from upstate New York. And I said, oh, really, upstate New York? Sure, you know, I've been up there. And she said, oh, do you know the temple in upstate New York in Middletown? I said, temple? I said, you're Jewish? And she said, yeah, and my mother's Jewish, my father's not Jewish. And my grandmother, you know, her dying wish was that someone in the family should practice Judaism. And no one ever has done anything. The last Jewish experience I had was my bat mitzvah. The rabbi put the talus around me and they got an aliyah. Then I thought, this is an opportunity I have to invite someone over for Shabbos. And I was very nervous, I was sweating at that point. I didn't know what to do. This is my first time really inviting somebody off the street, a Jewish person, to an experience for Shabbos. I'd, I spoke to my wife, and we decided we are going to call her up and invite her over for Shabbos. And we called her, and she accepted the invitation right away, without hesitation. And she came, and she joined us for Shabbos, and she was blown away. And we didn't have to do anything crazy. We just, the gefilte fish and the kogel and the chicken spoke for itself. And she had questions, and there were, answers for her questions and she had an unbelievable experience and I gave her any books I had for beginning of Judaism she took home with her. We packed up challah and kogel and gefilte fish and sent her home with all that stuff and she was blown away and she called again and my wife has been in touch with her and she's coming again for Shabbos and she's been learning and she's starting to learn Hebrew and it was all from just one experience of one invitation for Shabbos which I decided to, uh, to follow through like the video had said and just invite her over for Shabbos and hope for the best and it was really an unbelievable experience. What we've learned from uh, this experience and from Project Inspire is that really anybody could do Kirov and you could be anywhere. We were, I was in a, a Toyota dealership and I had an uh, opportunity to do a tremendous Kirov and it doesn't take a professional, it could be anybody in the world, just extending a Shabbos invitation and letting Yiddishkeit speak for itself. And I told her at the end, I said, you know, a million Toyotas were recalled also that you can come to our house for Shabbos. Mm -hmm.